Hi, Noah Nybaron here to show you how to test the battery of your tilt. I'm going to do a few experiments at lower and lower voltages to show you what happens as you lower the voltage of the tilt, simulating a battery that is slowly running out of juice. The bottom line is the green LED fires on the tilt on wake up. You have enough battery left. Or another brew. If the green LED doesn't fire, but the blue LED fires, which would fire when the tilt is put to sleep, then you have about a month left of battery. If neither the green or the blue LEDs fire, you have about two weeks left of battery. And to confirm that you do have a dead battery, you can actually remove the battery and reinsert it, and you would normally see a violet LED fire indicating it's ready to be calibrated. However, if the LED fires a red color with very little blue or no blue, this means the blue LED is not firing and the battery is very near dead. Thanks for watching. On with the experiments. I will try to wake it up. And I saw three green fl flashes. I'll put it back to sleep. And those were two blue flashes, confirming it went back to sleep. Now I'm gonna lower the voltage back to 2.6 volts. It is now set to 2.6 volts. I'm going to try to turn it back on. Okay, I saw a green LED flash, but it was very faint. I'm gonna to try to put it back to sleep. And I saw two very faint blue flashes. Now I'm gonna lower the volt I'm gonna lower the voltage to 2.5 volts. I try to wake it up. to put it to sleep. And I just saw two faint blue LEDs flash. I'll try to wake it up. As you can see, the green light will stop flashing uh, before the, the blue light does. So if you only see the blue LED and not the green, this, in this case, you're at about 2.5 volts. I'm gonna drop the voltage now to 2.4 volts. Okay, we're now at 2.4 volts. And the tilt is still working just fine. except for the LEDs, as we've been saying. I'm going to wake it up. Oh, I disconnected it. Let me um, reconnect here. And there you just saw a red LED flash.
that's for the calibration, which uh, we're not going to be doing. And you wouldn't see that under normal circumstances unless you were changing the battery. Okay, I saw two faint blue LEDs flash. And I'll try to wake it up. I'm fairly certain here that that uh, we won't see the green. And I did not see it. So we are still seeing the blue, however. So let's continue to drop the voltage to 2.3 volts. Okay, I've just dropped the voltage to 2.3 volts. And I believe the tilt is still Still working. Okay, it just turned on. I did not see a flash. I will now turn it off or sleep the tilt. Again, this is 2.3 volts. And I'm not seeing the blue LED fire. So neither the blue nor the green LED is firing. I will show you a trick. If I do the equivalent of taking the battery out, As you can see, when I put this 2.3 volt battery in, I do see a very red flash. Normally this is a violet flash, but because the blue is not firing, you see mainly red. So you can see how low this voltage is. Now we'll go down to the the lowest voltage that this tilt will run at, which is 2.1 volts. We'll show you how um, what happens then. So I'm going to drop it to 2.1 volts. Okay. And I will show you the LED will still fire when calibrating. So this, you wouldn't normally see this unless you're changing the battery. And normally you wouldn't be changing the battery to a nearly dead battery, but if you do want to test a battery, you can use this to test a battery that you're not sure if it is uh, still working if the battery voltage is low. So if you put what you think could be a low or almost dead battery, into a tilt and you see a red flashing LED with hardly any blue in it, that means that it is very near dead. And let's see, I'm going to, to um, test this tilt. It does appear to currently work. The first thing that will stop working is the temp sensor, which is right here. So I will try warming the temp sensor and see if it still works. So it looks like it is warming. So it is still operational at 2.1 volts. I will continue to lower the voltage to 2.0 volts. I will try the equivalent of putting in a battery of at two point at two volts. As you can see, it's a very dull red LED that fires. 
and I will test the temperature sensor. And I see the temperature sensor is continuing to operate. It's continuing, continuing to work. It's currently 83 degrees, 85. So the temperature is still working. So I'm gonna drop the voltage again to 1.9 volts. Okay, we're now at 1.9 volts. And I will put a battery in with equivalent of 1.9 volts, which is very low. Just saw that LED fire. Do that again. Very faint. And let's see. And now the temperature sensor stopped working. It's currently showing 32 degrees Fahrenheit which is zero Celsius, which is essentially a zero for the value. The specific gravity is still working. So there you go. I think if I go any lower, the chip itself, the Bluetooth will stop working. So I'm gonna cut it off here. This battery is very much dead. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.